Welcome to this video. Today I'm going to show you how to make a wrap operation in FreeCAD uh, for 2D sketch on cylinder. For this operation, we'll be using the Curves Workbench. For example, uh, I will show you how you can install it. Uh, you can go Tools in menu to Add on Manager, and in the next, um, we have to choose here. A curves workbench and install it. After that, we have you have to re restart your FreeCAD and you will get installed curves workbench in this tree. So let's start with creation of cylinder. So I will be using the default cylinder in part workbench without changing of this default parameters it will be radius 2 height uh, 10 and uh, after that let's go to curves workbench and in this curves workbench uh, for example uh, if we want to uh, make a wrap operation on this cylinder for the, for example uh, and we know to the sketch of uh, sheet metal mm, sheet metal plate for example uh, and uh, we won't want to create this 3d model of wrap uh, we can use it as a curves workbench let's choose the surface here let's choose uh, after that let's create a sketch on surface click it and here you will get a mapped sketch let's go to edit sketch and here you will get some box. Uh, this box uh, have the parameters of your uh, length of your cylinder, and uh, it will be this something like unfold um, body for this cylinder here. And if you will hide it using space toggle visible operation, you will get this box. And we can we can to create the some sketch on in this box and for example let's create this slot and let's set the some dimensions for this slot for example uh, the thickness use these two points uh, i use uh, hold down the control and left and choose this point by mouse and after that let's set this constraint distance between these two points I will set two millimeters here and let's set the length of this um, sketch between these two points let's choose it with hold down of control button on keyboard um, and let's set again this constraint, the distance. Let's set 10 millimeters here. And after that, let's uh, make the some angle of your uh, wrapping of for this of this uh, to the sketch. For example, uh, we can to go to toggle construction geometry. Click this, uh, click this, and you will get the blue lines and uh, use these uh, lines like a support uh, for set up these uh, dimensions or angles or main sketch so let's use the line let's set the line here let's set uh, for this line and this line let's set the angle let's choose um, hold down control button and left mouse choose these two lines and set angle between them constraint angle let's set uh, 45 degrees and let's connect uh, this um, main sketch with this line let's connect this point with this choosing this constraint point on the object and uh, now we have this point on this line and let's connect this line also with this this point with these lines using the control hold down hold down control button keyboard and let's set this dimension here and let's set this internal 
uh, internal on this box, this uh, sketch. So let's set to some random position. It doesn't matter because it's just a position on a cylinder projection. And after that, uh, just close a sketch. And how can you see? We have here some wrapped um, sketch. And you, if you activate visible cylinder space button, you can see that we perform a wrapping of this um, 2D sketch, this 2D sketch on your cylinder. And let's hide again this cylinder and let's choose the sketch on surface and perform fill faces. Let's draw it and you will get the surface uh, for your 2D sketch. Okay, after that, we can create the some thickness for this um, surface. Let's go to part workbench. Let's choose this surface. After that, let's go to 3D offset and let's set the some small offset for this. It will be a thickness between lines and uh, activate fill offset. It will create uh, the solid between these two surfaces solid body fill offset and you will get this 3d model of this um, uh, object solid body and after that uh, let's press ok and let's show the cylinder and how can you see we perform offset to internal part of cylinder if you want to get uh, the thickness to external part of surface cylinder let's go to offset and here we can just paste a minus for setting of our offset press ok and how can you see let's hide the sketch on surface um, before it and let's uh, choose our uh, object wrap it uh, slot and you can see that we have this operation and now let's hide the cylinder you can also save this body or convert it to another format so this is a full video tutorial about the wrapping of simple objects uh, thank you for watching uh, subscribe to the channel uh, goodbye